Uh, so after three or four days now, how do you feel like things are coming along for both you and for the team? Uh, I think things are you know, going really well. Um, you know, just being able to you know, build a connection with the guys on the floor, you know, getting ready for summer league, um, you know, just building those relationships, building those you know, great habits offensively and defensively. You know, it's been a great few days of work, you know, getting ready for you know, Vegas. And you know, I can tell that everyone, everyone in this building is excited to get out there. How excited are you to get out there and play a real game? Yeah, it's been, it's been a while since i played a, you know, a real game, live action. So you know, to get out there in Vegas, it's, it's going to be fun. You know, I'm really excited, really amped up to you know, go out there and compete again. Is the newness of learning everybody, is that pretty fun? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, you, you know, it's, it's completely different, you know, it's a different type of basketball, you know, it's obviously, it's not college anymore, so, you know, and you're really just trying to understand how, you know, all your teammates play, you know, how, you know, what they do to succeed, you know, how I could set better ball screens, how I could, you know, hand the ball up better, you know, really just trying to pick up on, you know, different players and, you know, how they need me to play for them to be, you know, very successful. You watched uh, Summer League throughout the years? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've been watching, especially recently. Um, you know, I watched a lot last year, you know, especially with, you know, Dama, Jordan, and Andre going into Summer League last year. So I watched a lot. Um, you know, it's cool seeing a lot of the young guys go out there and, you know, compete for, you know, spots and you know, just to battle it out. You know, this is why you play basketball is to compete. So, you know, I'm really excited. Uh, the religion I asked, too, is because a lot of times people talk about Summer League being a, a guards league and, and, and not as good for, for centers. Uh, your, your thoughts on that? Because it, it seems like some of the centers so far playing this summer have had some success out there. It's because the guards are gunners and ball hawks. Yeah, well, I'm not saying it's, 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 it's because of that. Because they're yeah. out there trying to get, get paid and they're like, well, if I score, I'm not yeah. passing it to the yeah. post. Go get no, my I, that's not an indictment of big men. That's an indictment of the league. Yeah. 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 I just, you know, for me, it's, it's about winning. You know, I, for me, it's not about the points. It's not about, you know, am I getting the social media, you know, recognition done. For me, it's just winning. It's just about, you know, how I can help my team win. It's not about, you know, scoring 20 points. You know, I'd be happier with 20 rebounds and, you know, seven blocks and, you know, five assists rather than, you know, 25 points. So, you know, for me, I really, you know, I'm just going to go in there with the same mindset of every other game and try to, you know, attack my opponent and just win. However, Coach Billups was bragging about your shooting ability. We've all heard these tales. Are we going to see it this summer? Are you expect yeah. to be unleashed a bit? Yeah, I mean, you know, if I'm open, I'm going to let it fly. Right. But they're going to run more plays for you, hopefully. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah, I mean, you know, just try to get myself into the groove of, you know, the league. Get, you know, just try to get adapt to the pace, the style of play. Um, you know, I feel like there's going to be some plays ran for me and also, you know, plays ran for me to get my teammates open. I think you need three to five threes a game, personally. Right, we'll see. We'll one. see. Yeah, <laughs> man, I'm, I'll get them up there. Kind of in that same vein, um, you know, there, there's been talk about, like, traditional centers not as... Not, not getting as much play in the NBA as they used to, but it seems like between guys like you and guys like Zach, it seems like kind of maybe the more traditional big center is is making a bit of a comeback. Yeah, um, you know, I feel like you know, on myself and, you know, playing against Zach, you know, I could tell how badly he wants to win. And, you know, we both really are just out there trying to do whatever we can to help our teams win. And you could really see that, um, you know, and that, that's what it's all about, you know. It's not about the points, you know, when, it, when you're big, it is about the rebounds, it is about the blocks for sure, but, you know, just trying to do the little things, trying to learn every day, trying to get better every day, you know, for me, it's just, how can I protect the rim at a high level? How could I defend at a high level? How could I, you know, be the best teammate possible? How could I, you know, learn every day, you know, be coachable and, you know, that's, that's going to find you playing time and, you know, if I just keep getting better, keep putting the work in, keep learning, you know, I know I'll be good. What have you learned most about yourself this um, week? You know, that I could you know, play at a high level, I could compete. Um, you know, there's a lot more things offensively that, you know, I could do that, you know, that wasn't able to showcase, you know, at the college level just because, you know, the style of play. But, um, you know, I feel like you know, I'm really excited for Vegas and I'm ready to show what I can do. All right, thanks, man. Appreciate it. Thank you.